The Story of Lord Krishna Lord Krishna's life and teachings have been a source of inspiration, wisdom, and enlightenment for millions of people around the world. Born as the eighth avatar of Lord Vishnu, Lord Krishna's divine birth and childhood pranks have been immortalized in Hindu mythology. However, Lord Krishna's life is not just a series of mythological tales, but it is also a manifestation of the ultimate truth, love, and wisdom. The story of Krishna's birth and life is told in the ancient Hindu epic. Krishna is often depicted as a charming, playful child and a powerful warrior. His teachings on the Bhagavad Gita, a sacred Hindu scripture, emphasize the importance of selfless action, devotion, and detachment from material desires. Krishna's life is also full of fascinating stories and legends, his victory over the demon king Kansa, and his role as a charioteer and advisor to the warrior prince Arjuna in the epic battle of Kurukshetra. Krishna's childhood is filled with many stories of his divine exploits and miracles, which continue to inspire and fascinate devotees to this day. If you interested in Hinduism, please like and subscribe Amelia Times for more interesting videos. Krishna was born in Mathura, in the northern Indian state of Uttar Pradesh, to King Vasudeva and Queen Devaki. At the time of Krishna's birth, his uncle, Kansa, was ruling Mathura. Kansa was a tyrant who had imprisoned his own father, King Ugrasena, and had taken over the kingdom. As soon as Krishna was born, a divine voice told Vasudeva to take the child to Gokul and exchange him with Yashoda's newborn daughter. Vasudeva followed the instructions and managed to exchange the babies without getting caught by the guards. Krishna grew up as the son of Yashoda and Nanda in Gokul. His childhood was filled with many miraculous incidents, which soon earned him the reputation of being a divine child. One of the most famous stories from Krishna's childhood is that of his playful pranks. Krishna was known to be mischievous and would often play pranks on the villagers of Gokul. He would steal butter from the houses of the gopis. Krishna's love for butter was so great that he would often go to great lengths to get it. Krishna was also known for his love of playing the flute. His music was so enchanting that it would attract cows and other animals to him. He would often play his flute while herding cows and would dance with the gopis in the fields. Krishna and Kaliya One of the most famous incidents from Krishna's childhood is his encounter with Kaliya, the giant serpent. Kaliya had been terrorizing the villagers of Gokul by poisoning the waters of the river Yamuna. Krishna decided to confront Kaliya and jumped into the river. Kaliya attacked Krishna, but Krishna managed to overpower him and dance on his head. Krishna then ordered Kaliya to leave the river and never return. Krishna and the Govardhan Mountain Another famous incident from Krishna's childhood is his lifting of the Govardhan Mountain. The villagers of Gokul were preparing for the annual worship of Lord Indra, the god of rain. Krishna, however, advised the villagers to worship the Govardhan mountain instead, as it provided them with food and shelter. Angered by Krishna's advice, Indra sent a storm to flood the village. Krishna, however, lifted the Govardhan mountain on his little finger to provide shelter to the villagers and their cattle. The storm raged for seven days, but the villagers remained safe under the mountain. Eventually, Indra realized his mistake and begged Krishna for forgiveness. Krishna plays a central role in the epic Mahabharata, which is one of the most important texts in Hindu mythology. The Mahabharata tells the story of a great war between two branches of a royal family, the Pandavas and the Kauravas. Krishna is a close friend and advisor to the Pandavas, and his teachings and actions are instrumental in their victory. Throughout the course of the story, Krishna provides guidance and support to the Pandavas, helping them to navigate the complex political and social dynamics that lead up to the war. One of the most famous incidents involving Krishna in the Mahabharata is the Bhagavad Gita, which is a dialogue between Krishna and Arjuna. As Arjuna prepares for battle, he becomes overwhelmed by doubt and despair and questions the morality of killing his own relatives. This conversation is considered to be one of the most profound and influential teachings in Hindu philosophy. After the war, Krishna returns to Dwarka, 
but his teachings and actions continue to be celebrated and revered by Hindus around the world. Overall, the story of Krishna in the Mahabharata is a powerful reminder of the importance of friendship, duty, and spiritual wisdom in navigating the challenges of life. Krishna's teachings and actions in the Mahabharata, his life and teachings continue to inspire millions of people around the world to lead a life filled with devotion, humility, and selflessness. If you like the video, please subscribe Amelia Times.